We're at the Ericsson OSS BSS Summit 2025 in London. I'm here with Cecilia Atterwall, who's Head of Global Marketing at Ericsson. Cecilia, thanks very much for joining us today. Great to be here with you, Ray. So um, uh, what are the main themes emerging here at the OSS BSS Summit? Well, first of all, it's wonderful to be here with all of our customers and analysts and media together co-hosting this event with British Telecom. It's, it's just an amazing opportunity to be discussing, as you said, some of the main themes of, our, of this event. The data-driven intelligence, the autonomous networks, but I would say an overarching thing is also the monetization opportunities. Because without what we're discussing here, you cannot sell, you can deliver, you will not get paid. So all of that sort of wraps it all up. Okay, yes, and of course that's an incredibly important thing for the operators, the monetization aspect of it. Um, and of course uh, all of the operators here are thinking about how 5G can help them uh, achieve their goals. Uh, how do you feel the industry is uh, evolving right now with 5G and especially with 5G standalone? I think this is like twofold. I mean, we have seen 5G happening all over the world. And in end of 2029, 85% would have 5G globally. The thing is standalone hasn't been as quick to pick up. It's really on that verge. And now it's when we see that happening. And without combining standalone, I mean, enabling it through the OSS BSS system, we will not be able to get to the full experience, but also again, delivering it and getting paid for it. Okay. And uh, here at the summit, um, you have plenty of operators here at the event, uh, and some of them uh, have been making announcements with Ericsson, so AT&T, Telstra, T-Mobile US. Uh, can you tell us about some of those announcements and the news you're show sharing here? Sure, happy to. I think there are all wonderful combination of different kinds of announcements too. So with Telstra, we're really trying to drive the industry forward through a collaborative effort to really see the value on how we can go from the business-driven use cases and delivering those with autonomous networks leveraging AI. And we'll be happy to share the outcome of those, those initiatives as well. T-Mobile, they're on that continuous evolution journey to really get the next level of evolved charging in place to monetize all the different opportunities that comes with their massive standalone investment. And we're there with them to make that happen. And of course, again, AT&T, that IoT marketplace that will enable them to drive the ecosystem forward on all of their IoT players that they are bringing together. And we're so happy to be behind and helping them enabling that to really happen. Okay, well, a, a great variety of engagements there with really big names in the industry. So uh, exciting times for, for Ericsson in the OSS BSS space. So Cecilia, thanks very much for joining us today. Thank you, Ray. Wonderful to be here with you.